Hello viewers, 4DIYers here with another video for everyone. In this video here I'll be testing if an ultrasonic cleaner can assist with removing rust. For this I'm using my ultrasonic cleaner from Vivor. It's their 6 liter heated 40 hertz version. A link to this will be included in the video description. It's an affiliated link, so with every sale I get a small percentage back to help keep my channel going. I added a jug of white vinegar, the cheapest stuff at the grocery store. It'll be filled almost to the fill line, any objects inside will bring up the vinegar level. I also added a small amount of pine salt to help remove any grease or oil on these tools. I have not used any cleaners on these sockets. These are impact sockets with surface rust in need of cleaning. I have a bunch of old tools that I'm working on refinishing before putting in my toolbox. The metal mesh tray is required so nothing is rubbing on the bottom of the tub so it won't damage the ultrasonic cleaner. For this setup, this can do a maximum temperature of 80 degrees Fahrenheit, but I'll go with 70 degrees Fahrenheit instead. Then I'm using a maximum time of 30 minutes. Once turned on, immediately I can see either dirt or rust forming inside the tub. The lid needs to be kept on so the liquid doesn't evaporate. After a 30 minute interval, it came up to 45 degrees Fahrenheit and the sockets do look slightly better. Here's a quick view. Some of the sockets can be flipped over as the ultrasonic cleaner may not clean both sides evenly. So I'll put the sockets back in for another 30 minutes and continue to heat the vinegar. After that interval, the ultrasonic cleaner finally came up to temperature. Some of the heavier rust buildup can be removed, however I decided to let it sit overnight. I then let it run for another 30 minutes in the morning. As you can see the solution is quite dirty in the ultrasonic cleaner. The sockets have a black appearance and this is quite normal when using vinegar. After that was cleaning up the black finish on a wire wheel. It comes off extremely easily. A small wire brush can be used for the inside of the sockets. These sockets weren't overly rusty. However, the heating action along with the high frequency sound waves, it appears to strip out parts, what I assume is softer material in the metal causing pitting. So if you are cleaning up something where you don't want this occurring, you can try diluting the vinegar with water or working in a much shorter time span. For these sockets in particular, I reapplied a black oxide coating to give that factory finish. Then the tools were soaked in oil to provide a protective layer. New videos released every week on my channel. Be sure to hit that thumbs up. It's a huge help to me and leave a comment below if you found this tutorial helpful. If you're not a subscriber, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thank you for watching.